Hey, what's up, everybody? Oriented Inverse here again. Hope you're having a lovely whatever day it happens to be when you're watching this. Yeah, I really don't. I, I need to get better at fixing this um, microphone setup. I say I'll fix it, but to me, I sound like myself because I don't really hear the audio that much. But when I do hear it, I'm just like, oh, it's not that bad. And then I'll, I'll, then I'll see, I'll be like, man, there's this moment where I got, ouch, where I got closer to the mic and I sounded actually like me in person versus like um, me and the mic. So today we're going to have a video about <coughs> exactly that. Exactly that. We're gonna have a video about what it's like to be, well, A, me when I'm sick, and uh, A, what it's like to be when I'm sick, B, what that usually consists of, and C, well, I think C is just, what is C? When am I over it finally? I don't know. C is just whatever C wants to be. C, we'll, we'll make up whatever C is. We'll make up whatever C is at a time. So first off, I just want to start off by saying that uh, tea of the day is spearmint. Oh, spearmint, everybody, I hope you had your cup of tea. Mmm. <sighs> Minty, delicious. Mmm. Mmm. I dislike how pale I look right now. Ah, you know, it's winter. It's winter. I can be a little pale in winter. I like that better. So what do I do? What do I do when I'm sick? What do I do when I'm sick? Very sensitive. I have a very sensitive nosy. And because of hence sensitive nosy, whenever I blow my nose, it like hurts a lot. And so I have to use like the, I, I try to use, I try to use the, um, whatchamacallit, um, I'm, I'm, obs I'm, I'm just too focused on this camera right now and I really dislike it. Oh. Well, mm, I don't like it when I mess with the settings and I thought I fixed it. You know what? You're just gonna, you know what? Just accept these interesting graphics. I'll give you something. I'll do some green screen fucking, I don't know, in the background, something like that. Back to the, back to the thing. Sick. Ooh. Um, when I get sick, I do the following. Uh, I deny it. Just deny. For quite a while. Quite a while. I mean, quite a bit of denial. I tend to, ooh, have my little trash bag just a big bag actually not, not a full trash bag I have a trash bag and I have a trash bag and I keep it next to my bed or I keep a little bucket next to my bed and that's where I have my my little pile of uh, napkins or whatever or just like whatever I blow my snot into or I guess it kind of depends on what I'm sick with usually it's just like a cold or something like that um, when it comes to a fever, it has to get pretty hot for me to realize that I have a fever and I realize that I'm like, oh wow, that's unbearably hot right now. Whoa, I'm kind of like unbearably hot right now and it doesn't make any sense because I'm in like a t-shirt and my shorts. What's going on? And then I'll be like, whoop -ah. And I'm like, oh my goodness, that means I'm hot. So then I just like, I'll also have one of these good old fashioned Product placement. Uh, purified drinking water. It doesn't have to be purified. It should be. It should be purified, and you should be able to drink it. So, that's. I do that. I have like one of those, and I try to go through about mm, maybe two a day, if I can, as much as possible, while I'm sick, of course. Back to my science days, my old scientific days, where I believe the, the I believe the phrase feed a fever, starve a cold. Starve cold, feed a fever. One of those two, but either way, I'm gonna eat. I need to stay hydrated, and I gotta flush everything out of my body, if possible. Obviously, if the good old-fashioned snot rockets aren't doing the trick, and my hot aren't also doing the trick, then I gotta step it up. The way I step it up is, there's, okay, there's a, there's a thing. There's a thing. There's a combination. We're gonna figure it out, because I'm tired of seeing myself fucking lose like three fucking shades of color every single time I move an inch to the left or right. See, now I gotta mess with the contrast, because, um... Oh, son. Or just, this is it. This is the final. Uh, this is what, this is the, what the rest of the video is gonna look like. I don't care. It's gonna look gross. People probably fucking upload stuff with uh, their phones, flip phones, whatever, some iPod Nanos or something, so we're just gonna, you're just gonna... Dude, I don't even know where I was. Okay, so I drink a lot of water. I eat a lot. 
I blow my nose as much as possible. I spit everything out. I should be potentially trying to get more sleep, but that's that's just an everyday battle, sickness or not. I always try to get more. I'm always trying to get my eight hours. I need to be care. I need to be more cautious of that, etc., etc. And that usually leads to why I get sick. I, you know, honestly, I have I have figured out. I have been ooh pains. This is what the actual video is gonna look like now because I give up. So, I, why do I get sick? I feel like, okay, so besides, you know, like the whole achoo and the flu spreads fast. Honestly, I think it, I don't, I, I try to stay, if you, if for, mm, I don't show this that much, but I'm pretty busy. I like to keep myself busy with a lot of random dumb things to do. By random dumb things to do, I mean like, I don't know, helping whatever I can, whenever I can, always doing something. Honestly, the only times you'll catch me like sedentary is when I'm asleep or when I'm reading a book or when I'm drinking tea or when I'm, I guess, playing games making shit videos for you guys and the last time i got sick um what was i doing I, I was training for i was training for my first marathon i think yeah 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 yeah, yeah. i was training for my first marathon and a lot was going on and i was just keeping myself busy and i was just doing what i had to do to do whatever i had to do that being said i let some things slip under the rug like you know keeping myself bundled up or something but i got sick anyway so yeah this time i got sick because i was running around a like that and then b i slept over at my friend's house that i was house sitting at and the heat was turned off but i was just like oh man it's just chilly like it always is you know in in minnesota you know classic 20 degrees all of a sudden nowhere so we just gotta be fine turns out that wasn't the case turns out they did in fact turn off their heat i didn't know that Man, I did, I did, I did know that. They said you could turn on the heat if you wanted it. And I was just like, oh, I'm probably not gonna spend, like, I'm not gonna sleep over. I'm just gonna, like, you know, feed the cats, water the plants, whatever, whatever. I got sleepy, and the eepiness got me, and I just slept on the couch. But I, I, lay, I had, like, three blankets on me, and I had my jacket from outside on. So I wasn't exactly not prepared for the elements. But that, I think that was the tipping point in my health because I was like, oh man, we're going, we're, we're going up this downhill battle. Like it's getting colder, you know, whenever I shower, I don't completely air, I don't completely dry every, every part of me off. I'm just like, you know, this is good enough. And then I go out and about and I do whatever I'm doing. And then I realize Jeepers Creepers that uh, I am now sick and it's to my own demise. What a surprise, what a surprise. That's why I got sick. Also, there were like people around me that were sick, and I was just like, you know, I got a pretty strong immune system because overall, I, I, I think I sort of do. I, it takes kind of a bit to get me sick because I, I spend a lot of time in the sauna, like four times maybe, or three times, three to four, three to five times a week. And so, you know, I'm in that baby cooking up, cooking up everything on the outside, inside. So I, I, I say that that helps because it, uh, virus-wise, it makes it unsuitable for the virus to sustain when the host's external temperature is around 220 degrees. Oh uh, yeah. Let's see what else I got. My little slip of things to say for you guys today. Oh. What I do when I'm sick? Oh, I'm a little baby, 100%. I'm like, well, honestly, I am, a, I'm, there's like phases to me being sick. There's the denial phase where I'm originally just showing all signs of illness, fever, get my sniffles <laughs> or whatever, fatigue. So when all those three babies are hitting me, I'm like, oh man, am I just tired? Am I just hungry? What's going on here? I'm not really putting it two and two together that uh, I might be sick at this point. Second phase, I believe I'm actually starting to sneeze and shit. I think I'm starting to sneeze at you. Third phase, that's when it's just downhill. That's when I'm, that's when I'm in bed. That's when I'm like, oh my gosh, woe is me. Somebody help me. Somebody give me some, put me down, you know, you know, those regular mind thoughts. When I'm sick and I'm just like shoot this is it this is this is how I go and then I'm just laying there and I got my little bundle of all these blankets I'm, I'm literally I'm just sweating as much out as possible because I'm cold cold sweats is that a thing yeah it's a thing I get cold sweats apparently um, as I'm now realizing but I still gotta sleep with my my feet out at night so maybe that doesn't help with me being sick but it helps me sleep I become a complete shut in. It's, I, sorry, I stay in the. I stay. I stay in my room and I just sleep, 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 much as I can. I watch my TVs, my animes, and I get it through. But I'm back. 
and I wanted to make this video because I I wanted to rush through this one video and like edit it and it would be sloppy and I don't want to give you guys sloppy stuff because honestly I am enjoying putting a little bit more effort every day every more day I try to push myself to do a little bit more when it comes to the editing process and uh, I want to do some good work more more good work I want to do more good work because I think it's ha ha he he fun fun and so I made this little I made this video what we're watching now hopefully you guys will understand that I got sick again ah, ha, ha, ha. and I will fill it with a bunch of random stuff in the background but I'm realizing now that the background is a little awkward awkward shape so yeah whatever you guys will yeah, well, well I'll figure it out I'll just I'll put something it won't even be visible it's just like shapes or something sensory I'll put some sensory fucking mirror in the background for you guys yeah yeah okay thanks for watching Thanks for all the support, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Sorry, this isn't as entertaining as one would, as I was planning it to be. But you know, hey, you know, just because we got a little ups and downs doesn't mean that it's gotta shake everything to its core. We're just at a down part right now. Best part of a down part can't get any lower. Straight up, wait. Straight up. Whatever you're going through, if it's being sick, if it's being sad, stubbed your toe, or got a paper cut in your knuckle, like the little webby part. It's just cold outside and you need to bundle up and you don't want to bundle up because you're like, I live in denial. Don't. That's how you get sick. Yeah. See you guys next time.